This past weekend, I had the most magical experience right in my backyard. Living in Champions Gate, Florida, I'm just a stone's throw away from the wonder that is Disney World. And guess what? I decided to bring you all along for a whirlwind tour with some of my fellow locals. It all started on a bright Saturday morning. You could feel the excitement in the air as we gathered, a group of neighbors all buzzing with anticipation. We were like kids again, about to step into a world where fairy tales come to life. Our first stop, the iconic Magic Kingdom. Walking down Main Street, I was immediately transported. The smells, the sounds, the vibrant colors, it was overwhelming in the best way. We caught the morning parade, and I'll tell you, seeing those characters dancing and waving, it's impossible not to wave back with a big, goofy grin on your face. And yes, we definitely had our share of Disney snacks. Mickey-shaped pretzels, anyone? Next, we dashed over to Epcot. The Flower and Garden Festival was in full swing, and the topiaries were just mind-blowing. We strolled around the World Showcase, each country's pavilion offering a slice of a different culture. The highlight? Oh, it had to be the fireworks at night. Standing there under the burst of colors illuminating the sky, surrounded by friends, it felt truly spectacular. Of course, no Disney trip is complete without some thrilling rides. Space Mountain, Splash Mountain, and the ever-mesmerizing Avatar Flight of Passage in Animal Kingdom. The screams, the laughs, the sheer joy, it's all part of the Disney magic. But here's what made this trip different. It wasn't just about the attractions or the shows. It was about sharing this experience with my community. Each smile, each laugh shared added layers to our day, making those moments shine a little brighter. As the day wound down and we made our way back, our feet sore but hearts full, I realized something. Disney isn't just a place. It's a feeling, a feeling of being connected, not just to the stories and characters we've all grown to love, but to each other sharing those moments. So if you ever find yourself in Champions Gate or anywhere near Disney, take that short drive. Go live out your own fairy tale, even if just for 10 minutes, because sometimes that's all it takes for a little bit of magic. Thanks for joining me on this adventure, and until next time, keep chasing the magic in your everyday life.